Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another video. Hola, bienvenidos a mi canal de YouTube. Por favor, le pueden dar un like y suscribirse a este canal. Like and subscribe. Subscribe. Okay, today I make it this video. It's gonna be called Spell the Tea. About a boy that came to my house. Okay, so I'm gonna spell the C about for you guys. Well, some of y'all. Okay, so it was this weird boy that I met on Facebook. Look on his Facebook, he was like very weird, I guess. But he was nice. But I guess he didn't understand what was what was going on. But he was like, oh, um, your likes don't work. Your private part don't work. Like, that's kind of hurt my feelings. Eso me dolió. Mis feelings, whatever that's called, whatever. Yeah. So, yes, I kissed him the first day. Like, I am very stupid for doing that stuff. But, yeah. This boy was weird. And, and, and then he was like, my family is weird. Like, no, my family is that weird, first of all. You are weird. And then his... He, I wanted to go out with... But then he said he didn't want a relationship. He was like, oh, why are you looking for relationships? Well, I told him we could be friends. He said, um, no. Okay, then I said, get out. Get out of my house. Like, bye, yo le dije, bye. La le gracias a mi casa because I don't have no time to waste time. He was actually weird. And then he just wanted to, um, you know, he just wanted to, you know, have sex. Like, he just was using me for that. This is stuff that you girls, we come through, go through. For dumb boys, but dumb boys that don't understand. How the hell are you gonna tell me that my legs don't work? I try my best to get them to work and walk right, but I guess he just wanted to f u c k. You know, I know what you girl understand, but please, girls, when you meet the guy. Act like an FBI. Ask him questions. Preguntale la cosa. Donde vive. Donde se pasa. Whatever you want to ask the boy. Don't just get straight. Do the things you do. Like, it was very weird. So, I told my best friend, my mom and my dad. I almost started to cry. But I said, no, you're not going to cry because there's plenty of men out there that want you. I'm going to show you what I'm getting. I mean, I'm going to waste no time on no boys that don't appreciate. And then he was giving me an attitude like, he's like, why are you so loud? And I told him, because this is my house and I be yelling all I want. But, yeah, meeting someone is like meeting your, meeting them as a trash can because they're just trash. I know some boys are nice, some boys are bad. Hay hombre malo y hay hombre bueno. So, I don't know what I should prefer these days. Yeah, he was kind of weird. Like, in a weird way, I could say weird way. And he said, oh, I like your mom. 
Dude, are you like my mom? That's a little weird. But whatever. The nice boy that I'm going to be, I'm going to meet him outside. I don't care if it's hot or cold. You got to stay outside. I don't want no man in my couch telling me I can't walk, right? I don't have, my legs don't work. La pierna mía si sirven, they work. They just don't have the same strengths of you guys. Like, it's kind of sad, but whatever. And the weird shit, you know, yeah. I, I just got a little mad about him. He was weird. He was so very weird. My mom always taught me not to shut up at nobody. Mi mamá siempre me enseñó a no callarse de nadie. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. And all he was talking about the first day, it was his fucking ex. And what kind of boy comes to my house and have his ex tattoo on his hand? Like, that's a little weird, right, guys? Es como caro de tener un nombre de su ex. Like, eso es bien estúpido. Like, take that off, like. Like, whatever. Why? And then I asked myself, why the hell you're going to meet me just to use me? Then he came to my house. He asked me. Um, I actually cooked for him. He was like, oh, your, your food was a little good. But the ribs I made, it was a little small. I said, then this is not a restaurant. I can't do nothing about it. Yo le dije que no era un restaurante. Para que ustedes tienen que estar hablando. You know what that means. Yeah. And then, the next time, he was like, oh. Um, I asked him what he wanted to eat. And he asked me for cereal. Like, are you kidding me? You come to my house, you would ask for cereal, and you would leave with attitude. Like, what the hell are you doing? Please, girls out there, please be a FBI to the first boy you're ever going to meet in life. Because I went through some stuff. And yeah. He was just weird as stuff. <sighs> then he texted me on my Facebook saying, miss you, and yes, I can see his messages, but I, I don't, I ain't see nothing. Because I was tired of that drama. Like, how the hell you gonna come to my house and tell me, oh, you like to work. You're probably about to work. It does work. See funciona. But yeah. It was a little weird. But this is the tea I wanted to say. Please girls be a FBI when you meet the first person you ever meet in your life. Cuando conozcan a su, you know, a su novio por primera vez. Some FBI because these men out there are weird. Especially the one that came to my house. Yeah. And I guess there's so many men out there, you know. But I was almost gonna cry, but I told my mom and dad. And that he wanted to, you know, I'm gonna spell it out. S U C K D I C K. Are you kidding me? I'm doing my 
I didn't do it to my ex. Why the hell? And then he told me, oh, all my friends do it. All my friends' girlfriends do that to the boys. Girl, boyfriends, whatever. <laughs> it's called. Like, I don't do that. Because my mom is not for that. And, yeah. Like, it was weird. It was so weird. And then he act like I, he know everybody. Like, boy, get out of my house. Like, I'm done meeting new boys in life. Because it's like, they're going to hurt me, obviously. Obviously, I always get hurt, but guess what? I don't play games with y'all. And then he was like, oh. I asked him, do you have a job? He's like, no, I just sell weed. And I told him, that's not a job. That's just a straight job. Like, boy, get out my life. <laughs> Bye. I'm too pretty to be your getting hurt. I'm too pretty to get judged by. I'm too pretty for this stupid stuff. Yo, ya estoy alta de esta cosa. So, the next man I ever be in my life, I'm going to be still FBI. Because it's good to be there. Investigate first where he live at, what he do, what his job is. Because there's so many weird boys out there. Like, what? I don't have no time to waste my time. Okay? So, if you girls want to meet somebody, please meet him outside your house. If you got a porch... Tell him to sit outside. It don't matter if it's hot or cold. Let him outside. Because they just want to be in your couch. They want to eat your food. And they want to eat your stuff. And they're weird. Okay? And like, it irritates me. Yes, he was nice. He was cute, but I guess his weird stuff just made him stupid. <laughs> so, yes, this is the tea I wanted to say. Esta es el que quería hablarles to las mis hermosas chicas por ahí. And everybody, yeah, you know, please. Don't do what I did. Okay? Just try to meet the guy first. Before you have a real relationship. And then you'll get it. Why boys are weird. Okay? So, I hope you... Well, this is the end of the video. I hope you like it. And, you know... I'll be doing more teas of these. <laughs> Bye. Lo quiero mucho, mi gente. Kisses to all my people out there. Bye.